art by Inked Playmats at inkplaymats.com. Your place for custom-made playmats. Design your own or shop from other featured designers. Use promo code CLOTSDILL to save 10% on your order. Inked Playmats. Your game, your style. ...to do on their website and come join us for a fun-friendly F&M environment. from Klotz Productions and welcome back to another Magic the Gathering gameplay. For this match we have Nick playing everybody's favorite deck to hate, Blue White Delver, and his opponent is also Nick who is playing Blue Black Zombies. To make it less confusing I will refer to them as Delver and Zombies from here on out. So Zombies started out on the play by laying down a swamp and playing a diagraphed ghoul. Then Delver immediately went to 18 to play a Gitaxian probe and look at Zombies hand. He wrote them down and drew his card and then he put an island into play and played a ponder. He took a look at the top three cards, but decided to go ahead and shuffle them away. Zombies attacked this ghoul on his turn, taking Delver to 16, then post-combat he played a Gloom Surgeon. Delver just put a Glacial Fortress into play on his next turn, then Zombie attacked with both of his creatures. Before damage, Delver played a Thought Scour targeting himself and then drew a card. He then paid four more life to play a Dismember and kill the Gloom Surgeon, then he took the two from the ghoul, going down to 10. Zombies then put a Drowned Catacomb into play and played himself a Mortar Pot. Delver just played Land Go again, and then Zombies attacked with his Ghoul again, taking Delver to 8. Delver then played another Gitaxian Probe on his turn, but he chose to pay for it this time, so he didn't take any more damage. Zombies then took Delver to 6 with his Ghoul. He then attempted a Blood Artist, however Delver countered it with a Mana Leak. It was alright though, because he had a second Blood Artist that he was able to resolve. Delver put a Seachrome Coast into play, but still wasn't playing any creatures. Zombies then attacked with his Ghoul again. Delver flashed in a Restoration Angel, however before it could block, Zombies played a Guest Verdict to force him to sacrifice it and lose one life. He also lost one life from the Blood Artist when his Angel died, then he took two more from the Ghoul, going down to two. Zombies then finished him off by sacrificing the Germ from his Mortar Pod to do another damage to him and take another life with the Blood Artist. This gave him the victory and took them to Game 2. So that's it for this gameplay. Hope you all enjoyed it. You can find the full version in the annotations at the end, along with links to my vlog and my Let's Play Duels of the Planeswalkers 2013. If you like this or any other video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and add it to your favorites, then subscribe to be notified when more videos are online.